Kevin, let's start today's session with the highs and the lows of your week. Well, on Sunday, I went to church with mum and dad. That was nice. And I've been going to the gym a good bit. And the lows? Well, I, I downloaded one of those apps again. Um, and I've been having negative thoughts. Lustful thoughts. I know it's disgusting. I know it's wrong. Have you been acting on these thoughts, Kevin? Tell me. Like I don't really want to talk about it. I just want to know what I can do to fix it. I've tried everything. Like I've tried praying. I've tried taking testosterone. I've tried dating women. Like I'll do anything at this stage. Man was designed by God and his image to procreate, to honor and provide for his wife. By living more like Christ, you will be able to overcome these feelings. But I... Freud suggests that sexuality is changeable and that the root of these problems usually stems from childhood deprivation. How was your relationship with your parents? Fine. Uh, normal, I mean... We would have been spanked if we did something wrong, but... Nothing out of the usual. Were you... interfered with... as a child, Kevin? No. No, nothing like that. This curiosity you have with the male form needs to be addressed if you truly want to change can I suggest um, an experiment a form of exposure therapy okay I believe that if you were less curious about the male body, you would be less fixated on same-sex attractions. I suggest we both undress in order that you can feel more familiar. It, it has helped many of my clients. Pastor, I... I don't think that's going to help. 